We call the September, oh, September, is that right? Yeah. Eight. Yeah. Yeah. September. September. Eight. Already. Meeting of the Board of Trustees to order. At this time, I'd like to take a moment of reflection, each one in our own thoughts and minds of the loss of Mary Ellen Farrell, now to most of us. we have uh, created some confusion with the placement of the closed session where it is as there may be some people who are coming on time to make public comment or maybe some who are plan on coming later because it will be a closed session first so I move that we add an item C1 which would duplicate petitions and communications public comment presentations and then also leave F where it is, so we do it when we get back out of the. Where are you putting C1? C1 would be uh, after we approve the agenda. And I move that we, we add item C1, which is petitions and communications, with item A, public comment, B, presentations, leaving item F as it is. So we'll, we'll basically have two times for public presentation. Yes. Okay, does everybody understand that? Is there a second to that? I'll second. Is there all in favor, please say aye. 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 Opposed, same sign. Okie doke. Do we have a motion? Oh, I guess we're going to have public comment. So public comment. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do we have some? Nobody has given me a card, so maybe we didn't need to do this. <laughs> okay. No one has asked to be addressed the group, so I guess we move on. Is there a motion to go into closed session? So moved. Is there a second to that? Second. Okay, we're going into the closed session for the uh, property acquisition and for mm -hmm. approval of closed session minutes. You need to read the chat. Five one L C S twelve one twenty dash two C and five one L C S one twenty dash two C twenty one. The other one's C5, the first one's C5 first. Okay, you missed the, the five on the next line there. The five kind of wrapped around. Oh, C5 on the first one. Five, one, L, C, S, 120, slash two, C, five. Thank you. All those in favor of going into closed session. Roll call. Roll call. Jane? Yes. Anna? Yes. Yes. Chris? Yes. Mark? Yes. Yes. Okay, let's, let's move for the consent agenda. So moved. Is there a second to that? I so second. All those in favor, please say aye. 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 Okay, would you assume that we have to approve, or did we just now approve those minutes? We've approved them. We just approved We've approved it. Okay, that's yeah. what I think. And that approves the bills of with, with that motion too. Okay, good. Public comments. I've asked this before and nobody had any, but we'll address it again if there's somebody. Thank you. Presentation. No presentation. Celeste? No presentation. Buildings and grounds. Any report? Technology. Finances. Bylaws of the board for discussion only. I just had one comment or question in section G toward the end. Section one again? G, G at the end, tenders at meetings. It says, you know, vacancies will be provided in section 4.4 and that and all that. Should that say with section 4.4 so you don't have to go look it up? Which I did. There's nothing on the paragraph that I yeah, I know, but I mean, there's a part, you could say it, you know. This is the language that um, the city legal council recommended that I use. We can certainly do something else that this is what they have recommended. Well, no, I mean, that's fine. It's just what, to say what it says in that section. Whatever you like. 
I don't know, because it just seems to me you have to go look it up, which you do. <laughs> 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 if That's you want to know what it says. Uh, I guess it's kind of long, but the whole idea of you're not there for a year or you don't, you know, you're unfit and all this stuff. But. Anybody else want to contribute to that thought? I'm living looking it up, but it just seems like this. Okay, an item that I'm thinking of, and I, this is one of the reasons I brought this forward, was the order of agenda. Robert's rules state that an organization can adopt an agenda only if its organi organizing documents do not include rules of order of dictating the order of a business meeting. And it seems to me like with when you put those in there, we're dictating the order, and I think we should be more, more liberal than that and eliminate the order of items. I, I don't find any problem if we want to list them that these are items that can be covered in board meeting, but that they have to be in this order. I think that's. You say the order of business may, may include. include. Yeah. I, yeah, I focused mm -hmm. on the may. There's a may include in there, which seems to me it's not mandatory. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, I think. Did we modify this last year? No. Well, no. Not that portion. Because I, I thought we had, had the agenda completely specified a, uh, a year or so ago. Mm -hmm. Maybe we did. I don't okay. think we did. So, are there other thoughts? That's my major concern here. I do think that we've got a, a concern as to the, what we've done in terms of a vacancy now is just that we've left it, that there's no way to remove somebody if they have been shown a no, lack of interest. <laughs> well, we're talking about two things here. Yeah, one, is, one is the order of the, uh, okay, the, order, the agenda, order, and the other one is the attendance policy, yeah. if, if there could be one. Order of the agenda. Let's yeah. cover that first, because that's where okay. we're at. Okay. Well, I, I had proposed this. Uh, because I, I would like to clarify the agenda and separate out action items from discussion items. And of the action items, there's individual and there's consent. Mm -hmm. And I will admit to sometimes be confused as to where we are in, in the agenda um, because we've mixed and, mixed and matched those things. Uh, so I actually did a draft proposal, which I think Celeste has, and you can share at any time. I've mocked up what an agenda might look like. If we change but if we, re if we remove the itemization of, or might include, then it can be in any order, too. Correct. And I think that's what we're, we're looking for, maybe. Correct. Well, I was thinking... And it's we, more we, a formatting issue than, yeah. than actually how business is conducted. And I don't think there's a big problem there. So that can be taken care of fairly easily. I think so, too. Yeah. yeah. That's... Okay, I, and I, I, I think at some point we might want to look at the... Bylaws, but I'm sure not now. <coughs> <coughs> so, Incidentally, any other I, I talked somewhat about this facts book. Mm -hmm. Was it last month or the month before? Last, last month. month. Anyway, chapter three has a section on this, so that would be worth okay. our looking at. Okay. But I think we need to. But so for that we tonight, can address the I issue think this now. is. Okay. This if is, we could just eliminate it, probably, for the meeting next month, the itemization of the items. Okay, so at what point do we want to talk about a possible replacement agenda format? If we don't have to do it, if we don't have to do it under the bylaws, it, it doesn't... Robert's Rules is suggesting we not have them in bylaws. So my suggestion would be to remove them for now. Okay. And in terms of a change agenda, maybe we will propose something to the... Uh, the members, and if, if it uh, receives approval, we'll use a new format then. Okay. Incorporate some of the, some of the a aspects I was just talking about. Okay. Make sense? Yeah. Yeah, I think I'd like to see what you're proposing. Okay. Yeah, I would yeah. like to see that. We, we, yeah. I wanted to have yeah. it. I, didn't, I couldn't get ready. Right. And we right. wouldn't have to vote on it next meeting, even though we're saying if you want to just, if you if there's enough discussion about it, we would postpone a voting. 
<clears throat> okay? Let's, the next item, I think, would be the attendance rule. How do we feel about that? All of us have been on the board long enough to, I think, to know that there have been some people who have been hindered from being able to attend, others who I have felt have lost interest along the way. And I think that may always be the case. But oh, I think so. But what I I'm think thinking so. is that uh, there are unintended consequences of, of the policy as written too, with the three, the three meeting in a row rule. I think that's... Um, especially if a special meeting or two special meetings come up. Okay. Uh, there's never a question as to whether they're considered or they're not. I think the general assumption is people are on the board because they have accepted the appointment and want to be on the board. Right. And if, if that proves to be not the case with, with individuals, then I think we should deal with that. But I don't think we need to have a policy that directs you to prepare a letter as, would, as we do right now. Would you eliminate it all? I would. How many others feel? I would eliminate it, no. Eliminate the attendance. I wouldn't. You would not? I would not. I mean, I think just saying members are expected to attend every meeting. Yes. I think that's a, that a good is, that is, expectation. I think that's fine to state well, that. that. That's, yeah, that's yeah, right. fine But with that. then yeah. not get into details about when you've crossed you got to do this and you got to do that or not and who needs to make the decision and yeah. letters and so on. And if somebody's really, you know, messing around and not showing up, then the chair needs to talk to them and say, are you still interested? And if not, why don't yeah. we resign? Mm -hmm. then we can and that, that expectation yeah. sentence takes mm -hmm. care okay. of that. Yeah. It could be really straightforward. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Got all those changes? That's what's Got in it. there. Okay. That will be next month's business. Report of liaison officers. Do we have anything from Jeff? Do you have anything to do? Uh, no, I'm going to point it to a couple of committees which haven't met yet because they can't get everybody together and everybody's calling in absent and things. So it's like a, we have an old attendance policy we could say. And they do everything on telephone and via um, cameras and whatnot. Um, and their agenda has little times right by every item. So you know exactly how long it's going to take, and it usually goes twice as fast. It's kind of amazing. It's interesting. Not that that's good, but um, <laughs> but it's very, uh, they would be through with this in probably 10 minutes or so. so. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, friends, Anna. Uh, you got information in your packet about the really very successful book sale. Uh, I'll add on a personal note, this was the first time that I have assisted with it. And it's an extraordinary experience. Uh, I was here on Sunday and people just poured in and the place was just popping. Um, it was absolutely fascinating and I will help again. And the fact that they made so much money is marvelous. And um, there were good I, books for those who missed it. <laughs> I have yeah. lots to prove it. <laughs> <laughs> and I must say, I had been asked to help take in money, but the chair <clears throat> of the Friends does it so fast. I wasn't even sure what was happening, so I said. I'm going to go and organize books, and I felt much more useful doing that. But anyway, seven thousand three hundred and seven dollars, best since 2012. Ain't bad. Um, they think that it was in large part due to the fact that there was really good publicity, and that it was on the same day or same time period as the Corn Festival. But who knows? The next one will be at the end of November, November 19 to 23. So since there's no corn festival, but we could still have good publicity, maybe we'll have another really, really good sale. Uh, the um, <coughs> friends will not meet in October, so you won't have a report then. Okay, that's it. Administrative report, anybody got any additional? Nobody, okay. Unfinished business, I know I'm wrong. New business, appointment of the Freedom of Information Officer. The 
two individuals' names who you see here have agreed to serve with this, so uh, we need a motion, I guess, to, in action to appoint Celeste and Becky because they're going to be co. When one's out, the other one can answer it. <laughs> okay. I move approval. Is there a second? No second. All those in favor, please say aye. 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 Opposed, same sign. Do we have a motion for adjournment? So moved. Is there a second? Second. All those in favor, please leave. <laughs> All right.